everyone. And I must confess, it's really difficult to talk after Triveni, sir. <laughs> uh, but anyways, I'll try my best. Uh, so my name is Vikas Jain, and I am from Nutanix. Today, I'll be talking about some of the things which Triveni sir also said, and some more things which we believe all the enterprises today are looking to adopt. Tell me one organization who is not looking for modernization, who is not looking for modernizing their existing environment, someone who is not looking to grow their business, compete with their competitors, and be ahead in the curve of technology. Each and every organization today is looking for this kind of transformation in their technology. But it is not easy. There are a lot of restrictions, or there are a lot of constraints that prevent people from modernizing their infrastructure in as easy way as they believe it would be. One major thing is the budget. The budget is always a problem with the organization, wherein they want to do a lot more things, but the budget constrains them from adopting a lot of new environments. The second thing is skills with the people. Today, if you have one technology, there will be people who don't want to change their, their, their skill set, and they don't want to adopt a new technology because they, they, they fear that they won't have the skill set and they won't be able to manage it effectively. The third team, Third thing is, is the time that is required to modernize the stuff. No one is going to modernize in a big bang way. They will always look for modernizing some stuff and then accelerating that modernization into the complete data center. With that, what I am going to tell you today is, it used to be very easy decision in the past. It used to be either on-premises or in the cloud. But today, with so many options for everyone, call it shadow, shadow IT, or so many options available to each one of the uh, corporates, there are so many places that they can run their uh, infrastructure today. They have come up with the idea of having the compute, having their applications at their robo sites, their branch offices, and as well as multiple public clouds, or they want to co-locate their data center into some of the environments. So there are so many avenues, and within a few years, they end up in such a situation wherein the infrastructure is spread across so many places. Now, is it easy to manage such a sprawl? Your applications at multiple places, it is, it is never going to be an easy. Nutanix uniquely provides the solution to the customers, wherein we can provide you the options of managing your data sprawl very, very easily. The main crux behind managing this kind of environment easily is having a common operating environment which runs on-prem, as well as your edge locations, as well as your branch location, or on the public cloud as well. So imagine you managing all of these environments using a single management console sitting at one location and managing everything from that single management console. This is the power of Nutanix, wherein we provide such a facility uniquely to our customers. Uh, but reaching to this stage is not easy. You know, the tools that are present today, they are not meant to provide such kind of uh, facilities to our customers. Uh, either they are too slow or they are too, too ex expensive. And at many times, people don't have the skill set to, to do such a transformation for their organization. So that's where Nutanix comes in and provides uh, a single operating environment for all of these locations so that everything can be managed very easily. 
If you look at this picture, it's a very, very strong photo wherein we provide a Nutanix cloud platform which can run any of your workloads. It could be any of the business critical applications. It could be your remote side applications. It could be your branch or office applications. We are certified to run with most of the applications that are running today. And you can choose to run your applications anywhere. By anywhere, I mean you can run it on-prem, you can run it on any of the public clouds, or any of the cloud service providers which are locally present in India, or to any other edge locations. The benefit that you get here is, with the help of Nutanix cloud platform, which is the common kadi between all of these things, you will be able to manage the entire things very, very efficiently. Now what happens is, lot of the times we place a workload at one of the places, say today I post my workload into AWS cloud. But the workloads are very, uh, you know, dynamic. Today it makes sense to put my workload on AWS, but tomorrow that may not be the right place. I should be moving it back to the on-prem or maybe to a different cloud. With Nutanix, these things get very easy wherein we provide you the facility, wherein you can move your workloads from one place to another uh, very, very easily and, and with, with, with very few additional skills required. So we did a survey wherein 74% per, of the corporates, they said within a couple of years, they would be adopting more than two clouds, which means it could be one location in the on-prem as well as multiple locations on the cloud as well. So, uh, out of them, out of those 74% people, 94% uh, said it would really help if we can provide a single management console or single uh, management operating environment using which they can manage all of their applications at all of the locations. You would be surprised to know that this Gartner report, which says within next three years, there would be 750 new applications that will explode the market. Now, it is not easy to handle such kind of application. It may, it may look actually very huge number, but I think this is the reality. A few years ago, the number of, the amount of data we were generating was pretty minuscule in today's parlance. But today, we are creating about 181 zettabytes of data every single day. This is all because of these new age applications which are coming up. These applications are generating more and more data at all of the locations. But one thing to note here is 50% of the data is generated at the edge locations. So, Edge location is something that cannot be ignored. And if I were to tell you these, the data that is being generated today, most of this data, about 90% of it, is unstructured data. You actually need a different mechanism to manage this unstructured data. It cannot be managed in the same way we manage the data today, like we put a sand storage and we provide volumes to the databases and all. Unstructured data needs to be managed very, very differently. And Nutanix provides you the platform wherein you can run your scale-out object storage, scale-out NAS storage, as well as your or virtual machines with databases and all on the same platform. This is our file services for unstructured data. <coughs> we provide two unique ways of handling your unstructured data. The one is, if you want to keep your data very, very close to your application, you can choose the environment wherein your hyper-converged infrastructure is also running your unstructured data. So with the same platform, we can provide you scale-out NAS as well as scale-out object storage. But if you have a different kind of purpose for your unstructured data, maybe to take backups or maybe to keep archive of your data, you can actually have dedicated uh, file and object storage as well. So these are the two models which we provide. 
And it is not just about storing your data. There is a lot of intelligence that we provide into the data. So with our data lens and data analytics, which are built on top of our data services, we can provide you a lot of information about your data. This is the AI that I'm talking about, which can actually tell you who is the user who is accessing the data at most of the times. <coughs> there could be some you know, users who are trying to access uh, the area where they don't have access. And this is able to provide you that information also that this particular user is actually trying to access the area which is, uh, you know, illegal for them. And as Triveni sir said, <coughs> there are some organization which have faced a lot of damage due to uh, malwares that have attacked them. One big thing to manage the malware attack, the first thing is to have a zero trust network, right? So you decide what data will be flown from one virtual machine to another, which we call east-west traffic, right? So east-west traffic is something you control so that there is no data which is unauthorized, unauthorized and is moving from one location to another, right? The second thing is, with our unstructured data services, we guarantee you, even if there is a malware attack, we will provide you a copy of data which is untouched by any malware. So Triveni sir said, Hamesha apna ghar lock karke jao. This is that lock that we provide, wherein we will guarantee you, even if there is a malware attack, your data will always be recoverable. So having said that, a uh, lot of customers are, uh, you know, delighted with Nutanix. One reason, one big reason is we provide a lot of flexibility or choice to customers. Like we are a software company, we provide customers the choice to use any kind of servers or hardware that they want to choose. We provide the choice of hypervisor to the customers. We also provide the choice of their uh, preferred cloud platform their cloud environment where they want to run. And we can provide you a single management console to manage everything through our orchestration layer. Right? Uh, we talked about a unified platform where you can run files, objects, and your databases, everything from the single platform. Uh, we, one major thing to note here is the net promoter score. Now this net promoter score is the testimonial of how satisfied a customer is after using Nutanix. We are very, very proud to say that our NPS score for last eight years is 90 plus, which is like unheard of in this industry. If you talk about any IT company here today, the NPS score would be in the range of 20 to 40, right? Our score, it's, it's such a high score uh, that it's a testimonial of our customer satisfaction. So wherever in your journey today you are, there are customers who want to remain on-prem but modernize it, especially a lot of our government and PSU customers who, who are not yet very ready to move to the cloud, but they want a modernized uh, platform on-prem wherein we have helped a lot of government customers to create their own private cloud. There are customers who wants bursting into the cloud. <coughs> By bursting, I mean they are running their application on-prem, but it's a seasonal application, and during some particular point in time, the demand grows exponentially. At that time, they can burst that application seamlessly onto the public cloud so that they don't have to be uh, ready with the huge hardware for, for the entire year while they need it only for a few months or few days, right? The third kind of customers are who wants to use both public and private cloud. They want to run some workload from public, some from private, and be able to move the workloads whenever they want, right? So we provide you services at all of these locations, and there are multiple customers who are taking benefit of uh, Nutanix in this way. Uh, as some of you may know, HCI is the term given to the industry by Nutanix. In 2009, we formed this company 
and uh, HCI as a term was given to the world by Nutanix. We pioneered it in a few years. We, we, the kind of vision that we had, we had provided a lot of services which was not very flexibly given by the traditional sand storage and sand uh, switch kind of environment. We are doing the same thing with the multiple hybrid cloud now. The same ease that we brought into the data center infrastructure, now we are bringing it into the hybrid multi-cloud environment. The fact that we can stand up a hybrid multi-cloud within a few hours, within a couple of hours, we can create an environment for the customer wherein they are ready to port their application onto the public cloud as well as their on-prem cloud. So a true hybrid cloud can be prepared in the matter of couple of hours. So these are the reasons why uh, people choose Nutanix. And we have a huge ecosystem of our partners, our uh, ISV partners, uh, wherein we both collaborate and we provide a world's best solution to our customers. This is our portfolio. It's divided into basically five, five parts. One is the cloud infrastructure which is the infrastructure services wherein your application will run. The second is the management. We manage on-prem as well as your public cloud with the same platform. Then the unified storage services, the, the block and file services that I spoke about. We have a unique database service where we can simplify your database operations tremendously, uh, starting from uh, creation of a database to entire lifecycle management, say, patching of the database, taking backups and uh, scaling up and scaling down, all those things can be done very, very easily through the Nutanix platform. And then there are VDI services also that we provide. So this is in the nutshell about Nutanix and uh, we would love to, uh, you know, uh, connect with you whenever it's okay for you. Thank you so much.